Hello champions, it's time for another Forgotten Gem, aka the com uncommonly used common guys. So this time it is going to be Goldust Shattered Dreams, that is Striker Goldust. I've been saying forever that he was next, I just didn't have time to get through it. Now we're going to do it, and it's actually going to be a pretty short one, because you pretty much have one moveset that's going to work. So we'll have a look. It is first... His trainer ability at 5,000, it's received 30% less damage from Black Gem, so you're pretty much unlikely to ever use him as a trainer. Links with Booker T and Goldust, the Rhodes, and Attitude Era, and only one gear. We're going to see it at 4-star gold. Obviously, mine is not 4-star gold. That was sent to me by Scopely. I believe mine was 3-star something, something like that. So that's going to be restored once they take this one away. Move set is going to be black one and bulk green. It's going to be the curtain call, 13 MP black move. Finisher deals 31.3k damage and destroy five random power gems and pin the opponent. The DDT 9 MP green move deal 21.6k damage and choose five gems to make into power gems of strength 3300. Running clothesline, 8 MP green move, deal 19.2k damage and make 8 random purple gems into black gems. Trainers for that are going to be steel, so we start with more green and triple H, so we create more power gems. The reason I'm not going with someone like Titus, for instance, that would make even more black gem, is because you're already making 8 of them. The chances that you would have 12 purple on the board to make into black are fairly low so it's pretty much a waste plus you could always use someone like uh ogan for instance uh, that would create one extra but i mean chances are if you got ogan you're probably not going to be using gold dust so also if we were to use someone that destroy more power gems that's kind of useless as well because even if you destroy nine but you're only making five you're wasting them. So the best here is to simply create nine. You're going to be destroying five. And there's four of them that are going to remain on the board and do damage. So that's what we'll be using. Coaches in this case are going to be DX Triple H to help with the green. And Elias to help with the black. All right, let's do this. We're going to go against Jeff Hardy. The reason we're not going versus uh, Seth Rollins is because of the striker advantage over uh, the uh, tricksters. If we also have a look at the active buffs that we're going to have right now, we got 15% more health and gems do 50% more, more damage from the feud boost. Uh, take 10% less from the all color move pretty standard and 10% more health from the tour uh, perk don't have anything that affects the MP right now the main issue here is that the moves are expensive well, we're pretty lucky we go we get both like this is the best we you could hope for we got green and black to begin with okay so now we make random purples into black but before we do that we're, the, we're gonna create those gems uh, that we're gonna be destroying after because it's already going to trigger some damage on it. Unfortunately, we don't have a lot of green. Normally, you wouldn't want all nine on greens. Right now, fortunately, we don't. We're going to put some on black. Unfortunately, it also means that there's a high chance that we're not going to destroy the greens. Now we're going to be using that. And we're even going to have to destroy one of them. Then again, after this, we might not even have five left. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> OK, 
Okay, well now we're gonna use the finisher. We got two of the greens, that wasn't great. Think this. We're out. Can't match any green because I just destroyed it, so we're gonna go for black. This is not going too well for us because, again, no green. I got a finisher I can use, but I don't have any power gems that are going to benefit from it, so... Use this, I guess. You gotta wait so that he's done. Use the finisher anyway, because just the damage was gonna be enough. Well, that worked, but it definitely showcased that he's a fairly weak striker. I mean, the issue here were obviously that you have issues loading that green up once you used it, and uh, the the cost of the move is kind of high as well. We're gonna give it another shot. Let's see you. I don't have another move set to show you guys, so we're gonna we're gonna try this a second time. All right, so this time we don't have any green to begin. We do have some black, so we'll go for that. Now we do have green. Again, unfortunately, we don't have a lot of green on the screen. We got five. We'll be converting the uh, purples into black after this. Uh, I was almost thinking on not using more so that the green could get destroyed, but yeah, whatever. Let's convert into black. Okay, let's use this here. Did a hundred K. Out of those nine that I put, only four remain. We'll break him. Again, we're going to have an issue that we're barely going to have any green. And not much on the board. Oh, there's one there. Is it going to remain? Probably not. Uh, 
Um, no green match. If I make this move and drop those, he's gonna have the green match on the next turn. I don't want that. Oh, I gave him a green anyway. Well, there goes the remaining green. That's definitely not the right opponent to showcase this. No green, no black. Dodged. Still no green. Let's make black. Finishers completely use less, except for finishing the match. Won't do anything since there is no our gem but it's still at least we'll still get the win One, two, all right well that is pretty much it for gold striker obviously it is viable once at four star like that but it's not really due due to the moveset doing much it's more due to the fact that he's a striker and gem damage does what it does for strikers uh, I would definitely recommend using a much, much better striker than he is and not waste your resources on him. But that's a way to, if you got to use him for a tour that he's required or something, that's definitely one way you can run him at four star. Thanks for watching. If you're not already a sub, make sure to do so to be kept aware when I post new stuff. If you have any questions, ask them. And if you like the video, leave a like and share. See you guys. Gio.